Hi everyone, welcome back again to our channel. This is Banji from Mama Ann's Corner. This time, I'm going to share to you another project that I made that I will put in my craft fair. And it is a um, very cute mini bag um, where you can put some goodies or I uh, put uh, uh, goodies in there already um, so they can just buy it and give it to someone. So the craft fair is more about Christmas so that people just buy whatever gifts that they want to give for someone and i copy the idea from the push paper lady so if you haven't heard about her you can check her out i will link down her channel below and so you can see how she made this kind of project so there's no need for me to show you how i made because you can see it in her channel and if you want to subscribe her channel just let her know that I sent you. So, I wanna um, show you the different designs. Although there's there's one um, style, but different designs of papers that I use. So look at that. It's so pretty, very very cute, and it's really really beautiful. That you can just really uh, want to buy this for a gift. <laughs> Just imagine like um, you put some gifts inside so and it's unique and pretty so what I did is um, I just copied her idea about how you made the the mini bag but of course I used different kind of uh, papers and different ribbons and some other style so what I did is I made a tag like this it looks like a um, it's a jar a mini jar so you can write something where you can just give this gift too so I use here the Christmas uh, paper which is the red one and you can see that I use a different color in the side so it would be more pretty to look at it's not just really bland or plain and I really love this kind of project because I can use some of my scrap paper like uh, the handle and this side one so I believe um, you have also some other um, crafts paper that small sizes and everything and sometimes it's hard for you to see to, to um, don't know where to use it but this time I enjoyed doing it because I was able to use some of my um, scrap papers and as you can see I think you have an idea now that what I've been using in this one so um, there's a fastener dots the same thing with the push paper lady she used this fastener dot, dot here to uh, make it a closure and so you can see that this is what it looks like so the same thing um, I have to put some paper in here so it would stands out stand out so this is one of the design again I will just show the same project but different designs and so you can see that I use a lot of scrap papers in here just like this one so I just um, blend it with a color which I look like it can uh, it's nice to combine it with this color so again I just put a ribbon in there and there's a tag in here and the bling that I put in here is color green because the other one is purple col purple col color right <laughs> and I'm sorry about how I pronounce it sometimes it's hard for me okay another one is this one as you can see it's more about the christmas paper and this time it's a green color as well and so most likely it's just this kind of style but different papers that i use so i'm just showing one by one so that you will see that um i've been using different kinds of paper see this is how it looks like 
of course i have to make some tags still for those others that has no tag the same thing with the two uh, mini bag that i already put i will make a jar a little jar with this one i put the uh, um it's like a small beads a pearl in in on top of the handle and this is how it looks like so um with the paper with the push paper lady i think she put a beads uh on the bottom i don't know if it it helps for the mini bag to stand up but if it's plain uh plain I believe it, this will really just stand up stand up um, the surface that I put is not plain so that's why sometimes it falls down but this is the different colors guys different designs I mean different style of the papers as you can see I use different paper also on the side so for those who have a lot of scrap papers um, you can um, have an idea now what to do with it by just making this kind of project then you can be able to use some of your craft papers so I'll just put it down and that and this is one of my favorite this looks like a um, looks like vintage right and the last but not the least is this one so that's what I've been doing for the past few days. You can imagine that I've been enjoying uh, making this kind of project because of course I was able to use some of my scrapbooks and some of my um, other things that has been stuck in there like um, the beads, the bling. So I was able to use and even the paper papers that I had that been stuck um, for, for a long period of time. So I was able to use it slowly by slowly and so I'm just uh, having fun doing this kind of projects guys and I'm just looking forward for another project I'm going to do because I have to make a lot of project so that I would have a lot of choices this coming craft fair and so people could enjoy uh, seeing a lot of different kinds of items. So that's it for now guys and hope you enjoy um, this video. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe for those who haven't subscribed. So you can see more of the project that I've been doing. And of course, um, of some other videos that we had, like the whole. And um, hope you can just comment down below what you can say about this uh, mini bag. And I think that's it for now. And thank you so much for watching, guys. And, and hope you have a great day. Uh, see you next time. Bye.